of the PCROT study is really quite simple. You can go online. All the process is there. Uh, you simply click on the register now button and then you go through the consent form um, and you fill out your information of data, of demographics, etc., what precursor condition you have. Um, if you are willing to give your authorization for our team to contact your medical providers for us to get all your medical history information, you can sign that, that uh, consent there as well. And then the final step is an intake survey that takes you through all the medical history, your family's medical history, and anything that we think might be relevant to your disease. This process only takes between 20 and 45 minutes to complete, and once you complete that process, you're registered officially into the PCROWD study. So once you're registered to the study, we send you out two to three collection kits, depending on what your precursor condition is. Usually, MGUS patients are followed by their own medical providers every six months, so they will probably get their blood drawn at that time. So we would ask for MGUS patients to send us samples when they're being clinically drawn for their precursor condition. For smoldering patients, sometimes they're seen more often, so like every three months or so. So we would also send them kits for every three months. For MDS, also six months and MBL also six months. So basically what I do is that I send these kits that contain all the materials that you need. This means it contains the test tubes, the instructions, all the packaging materials that you need to send us the sample back and all the shipping air bills. So really the patient does not have to pay for anything. All they have to do is go to the clinic that they're being seen at on the date of their appointment and ask the technician to draw a courtesy blood, which happens after you've gotten all your clinical samples drawn, the technician will then draw three extra tubes. And once you have those tubes, you follow the instructions of how to package it, and you just put it in a FedEx box or take it to FedEx or even have FedEx pick it up at your house. When you're getting your blood drawn, make sure that your appointment is between a Monday and a Thursday, uh, just because we need to receive your sample uh, up until Friday. We're not open on weekends, so you, you want to make sure that your sample is drawn then so that when it comes to us, it, you know, it should come the following day after it was drawn, just to make sure that uh, the sample is viable for processing.